All right, guys, welcome to a different type of video. So as you can see by the title, we're going to kind of be making a new uh, triple S binder. So I recently saw that a lot of people um, have been using these different types of binders. So I have like this A5, I believe. I'll leave all the links to these in the description. I bought from this K-pop store. Um, they have some unique type of things. It's actually based in USA, but it's all uh, Korean products. Um, so here's like the first set of uh, pages we're gonna be using. They're like six pockets. I mean, you can kind of see it's a little A5 like wide binder that's kind of a little bigger than the normal ones would be because usually they would just be four pockets, um, but they're a little bigger to fit that. And then I have these uh, four pockets to put in there as well because I have a couple bigger inclusions. And what we're gonna do is um, we're gonna make a triple S binder. Um, as well as I have some stickers to put on the front that I uh, got from the binder or from the albums I have. So you guys know my main bias is uh, Yu Yan. So I have her member sticker. I actually found an album I had that fit it. And then I have two uh, Acid Angel from Asia um, sticker sheets. I don't know if I'm gonna use both, but I have two in case I want to. Um, I wish I kept some of my object packs because uh, I wanted to take the stickers off there that says like Adam 01 special class or whatever and put them on the cover. But I guess I'll just have to wait till um, I have a bunch of albums still coming in somehow. So I'll just wait till I get one of those and do that then. So the first step, like I said, we're gonna get this uh, binder open. Um, sorry about that, we'll get this open. Uh, so yeah, oh, here's the name of the shop right here. It's uh, Mochi Things. So these are all Korean products, but I think they just, I don't know if it's theirs or they just proxy it, but anyways, they're US based, so it's not too bad. Because otherwise, some of the stuff you need to make these are pretty difficult to um, get. You have to use proxies or high shipping costs and that sort of thing. Um, so yeah, here's what the cover looks like. It's just the clear binder, which is kind of cool. And then it's got that little um, thing, kind of like on that Walpurgis night. But what I like about it is it's got the notch there, so it kind of catches it. So I think what I'm going to do, we'll start out directly with the, uh, the Yu Yan sticker in the center there. And we'll literally just put this right in the middle that and let's see what else we got I think we'll put the black little outline heart there like maybe right there I'm actually gonna use the other one as well right there like that uh, let's see from Asia to cover up that logo in the corner from the binder because it looks kind of cool. Um, and then I'm going to take some of these. Um, to cover up the little one over here. I'm going to do that. Take the red one like that, kind of make a little 3D effect, and we'll do the orange and red one, I'll call it the Iron Man one, like that, looks kind of cool. Um, and then since I think technically this is Yu Yan's color, the pink, We'll put that like that. And then her text like so. That looks pretty cool. Um, and then of course we're gonna use the uh, 
Triple S. Cube logos. We'll put them in the corner like that. Um, and then we'll put, we'll start up here, put the Asso Angel from Asia logo up there. And then put this uh, assemble sticker like that. And I think for now, that might be what I want it to look like. Um, that way I have space to add more as they come out. So we'll open it up. Let's see, how do I open it here? Do I just press down? Okay, cool. Um, and we'll get our photo card pages out. There we go. They fit perfectly in there. All right, guys, I'm back. So this is a different day because um, I realized these sleeves I normally do. So these ones, the dragon sleeve, classic clear, um, are actually too big to fit in these pages. So what I did, I ordered a new type of dragon clear, or a dragon shield sleeve, so we're gonna test those out right now. These are the mini Japanese size sleeves. You can see already there's a pretty big difference. Let's see how they are for triple S cards. Really nice, really nice side of fit. We'll test this out. And yep, awesome, it fits right in there, nice and secure as well. Actually like basically perfect fit. So we'll go ahead and continue with that, as well as over the last couple of days I thought about how I wanted to design the rest. I'll actually just take this box out. And kind of, I figured I'm going to put my, like I said in the first clip, just my Yu Yan uh, first class objects in here for now. And we'll see from there. Later on, I might put my other members. Yeah, these leaves are nice. Honestly, I might just completely switch over to these from now on. Let me know what kind of sleeves you guys use, um, just in general. Interested to hear. I just like these because they're like, they feel like if they uh, make your cards feel safe because they're like pretty thick as far as uh, sleeves go. So there's that. We got a whole first page done. Like so. Looks pretty nice. Um, I don't have the full set. I'm just missing 107. So I'll leave a spot open for that. Right there. And then I, like you saw when I was testing, I do have um, what you call on the Cosmo app the grid object. Uh, one of them, 201. They actually gave these out as like pre-order bonuses if you bought like the uh, AAA album set on Korean websites. So there's like hardly any of these and they're really hard to find. I managed to find someone selling the uh, a Yu Yan one. So I do have one of those. It would be nice if I could get the other one, but like I said, it's pretty hard to find. So I'm not expecting it, but it would be definitely really cool. Um, so then we have her second editions, which are 109 to, oops, wrong pile, 109 to 116, which that's to be 109, 110, 111, 12, 
12, 13 is right here. We have one fourteen. One fifteen, which is one of my favorites. And one sixteen. Like so. And I think actually, um, I'm gonna put my sewing on the, the face. A special class object. These are actually really hard to find um, on this page on the bottom as well. Even though it's not technically hers, I wouldn't have anything to put past on this page anyway, so it works. Um, and then next up, what we're going to kind of do is um, do AAA. So we have all of Yu Yan's. And I calculated it out, or I kind of, I guess, planned is more the appropriate word. Um, that her four album cards, and then her uh, Hello 82, and then Soundwave uh, benefit card kind of make it so uh, it matches up pretty well on a page. For, and I have the whole four members done, so it'll look pretty cool. So basically something like this. And then we have the pre-order card I was talking about, which fits pretty nicely as well. And then like that, so it looks pretty, pretty cool. Turn down the light so be less of a glare. Yeah, I think I have to keep it on, I guess. Oh well. Pages are getting stuck together because they're brand new. Um, so then next up we have a uh, Nak Young. I think this one's my favorite, the 209. There we go. Nak Young is complete. And now we have Yubin. Hers is really nice for the uh, Hello82 object. Uh, the first time, fun fact, the first time I pulled this one, uh, when I went to go scan the QR code, it gave me a different one. So they actually ended up, I contacted their support and they actually gave me a second one of those for free, which was pretty cool. It was pretty weird that that happened in the first place. There we go, there's Yubin. Okay, last up we have Hayden.
we go. Have her all complete. Looking pretty good. Um, and then we actually don't have enough pages to finish what I wanted to do, but we'll start it either way. Um, so what I'm gonna do for act or for um, assemble, I'm gonna kind of put each member. Um, the 207 and then the 208 kind of like together. So it would be something like that uh, for Soyon. So kind of keep go ahead and doing that. But obviously you saw I only have two pages left. So for now, we can only do the first six members, uh, which is fine because I consider this uh, a successful organization so far. I kind of wanted to just test it out so far before I committed to buying a bunch of pages. So it works for me. So we got Aiden next. And then we got Chibu. I don't think I have her 208 yet. She was like one of the few I don't have yet. So I can just leave that second space blank. There we go. Then we can find Cheon, who I definitely have. We got Yuyan and Sumin. And I don't have the second Sumin, right? So yeah, guys, the next video, um, I should have another card organization, kind of the general one. Uh, that's not triple S specific. Ready to go. And then I think I'm going to be doing uh, an indie binder reorganization. Like you guys saw uh, the one over the last time I did a tour, putting away card video. It's kind of starting to burst because it's so small. So I have a new one prepared. That we'll uh, take a look at and uh, start adding to. All right, so there we go. We'll kind of start at the beginning here and do another flip through. These pages are kind of sad because I don't have a lot of her second editions. So there we go. So then, next up, I wanted somewhere to put these larger type cards, because I did quite a few of them for Assemble Era. So what I went ahead and did, I bought these sleeves that are ten or four pockets that should be able to fit them inside. So we're going to go ahead and add those. I do only have two right now, like I said, but I do have a lot more on the way. We have a Soyan and a Aiden, and then Cheon and Yubin. So, did I put them in backwards? I, I did. <laughs> there we go. So we can put them right in there. And yep, they fit perfectly. Like so. So yeah, that looks pretty good. I mean, it's kind of a shame, like I said, I'm only going to be able to put four on a page, but at the same time, it's nice. 
so yeah that's basically it for this uh this binder for right now just wanted to bring you guys along on making a new collection let me know what you guys thought down below remember to leave a like we can join our discord the link is down below and i'll see you guys next time peace